Assalamu alaikum viewers welcome to my channel you know why study if you are new on my channel please subscribe and press the bell icon so you will get the notification of all the new videos in this video we will try to learn that how we can show the sequence centenary analysis or the similarities among different sequences in circles we will draw the circles to show that the our curie protein or our family genes protein have how much similarities with the other protein sequences in different crops or how much centenic region or evolutionary region are present among these protein sequences so how we can construct this beautiful circus diagram to show our results let's start for this you need two files in one file that is named as curie sequences it contains the protein sequence of your gene family for example you are working in a, a, a gene family that i am working on hsp70 and these are the protein sequences of hsp family genes in my studied crop like it is the hsp70 proteins in solanum lacoparsica and this these sequences we will use as a curie protein well the other other file contains the hsp70 protein sequences in other crops like these are the hsp70 sequences in oreza stiva and these are the hsp70 proteins from at arabidopsis thaliana and these are the hsp70 protein in zia maize or maize so i have chosen these three crops you can add more crops sequences of your studied protein so we i need or i want to sh show that or look that my crops that is solanum lycoparsicum hsp70 proteins have how much similarity or identity or the evolutionary background through centenic regions showed in the circus or circular diagram so how we will construct we need to open the link that is tool.bad.inspire.org circulato the link of this website is given in the video description so first you need to copy the curie protein sequences select all copy and paste it in the first or curie fasta box control v now copy the your other crops hsp70 or your protein family genes and then paste it in database fasta now there are some options here you tick on or select the run t blast x for dna versus dna and here you can select that only show the best hits per curie that the two genes that have the best curie or identity so they will show and here on which basis you want to show your data or e value or bit score or percentage identity so i select bit score you can select any of them and here use absolute score ribbon coloring that the result shown in in which color if the similarity or their relationship is less than 50% then it will shown blue if 
the less than 70% than green if the relationship was less than 99.99% then it will be orange or if other so it will be red so you can select it or leave it as you want and then at the end here you can also increase the size of your uh, figure increase or decrease anyone you want and here is the output format and here is a blast score or you can also change from here i select this blast score and click run circulato so the process will start and it will give some information about this that about monitoring the resource used going through the fasta files there are 21 entries found in the query file that our query file contains 21 entries while the 69 entries were found in the database file and now they are running creating ribbon from 21 local alignments that these our query protein that has the 21 so they will give the alignment of each protein with the other from the databases so here are some other options that it gives that uh, if uh, the coloring ratio is less than 20.25 bit score if the bit score between two genes is uh, less than 0.25 it will be shown in blue if uh, it is less than 0.5 then green if the bit score is less than 75 then orange if the bit score is greater than 0.75 then it will be shown in the red there are also some other options that will give you and now at the end so it will give us that circleto or circus that shown that these are the red so it means that their bit score between these genes is greater than 0.75 percent well this is the yellow or orange so it will shows that orange is less than 0.75 percent so between between these two genes a the bit score is less than 0.7275 percent you can click on it so see that ATHSP8 and SLHSP15 the relationship or bit score is less than 0.7% so th these are shown with more than 0.7% but here you see that we it is only shown the genes in between they have the uh, queries or have the relationship the other genes like uh, here we we add zia maze we didn't see any so it means that their uh, relationship between hsp70 from the salmonella coprosecum and the hsp70 between uh, in the zia maze have less than 0.2 percent or like this so that's why they didn't shown here so easy way to right click on it and save image as and then save it into your destination folder so if we change some options in the previous in this window if we give it here from bit square to percentage and then if we click on circulato so here is also give that if the similarity is uh, less than 50% so it will be blue or like this so here it shows that minimum and maximum identity if the it will give the identity if the be between the identity between two sequences is minimum must be 64 percent if the identity between two sequences is less than 64 percent so it will didn't show 
it has decided to show that identity up to more than 64 or more than 64 percent so that's where he the software discard the other sequences that in media mail or some are in error boxes or some in a uh, other or rather style that have the identity less than 64 percent so these are the it shown only that sequences that have the close relationship or evolutionary relationship or have the identity more than 64 percent from here you can see the alignment of each gene with the curie protein so there are the curie protein and this is the subject protein so there are the alignment of these genes so here if you drag down so it will give the alignment of each gene with other if we go back and here we can take this option that only show sequences that produce hits and then select the circulator so it will give us the all genes all genes but it only shown the identity which have greater than 64% if they have the less than 64% so it didn't shown and they are remain empty so in this way you can make the circles by showing the centrally analysis between two genes or the identity in a beautiful way and also you can make some changes in the option to make it more clear when you get your that figure up to your requirement then you can save it and use it into your manuscript hopefully it will help you please comment like and share thank you